Vita Nostra is darkly haunting. It was a consuming emotional journey that filled my head in you know, the best way possible. Instead of being drawn into the story, I felt like I fell into it like it was a well, and I could not get it out of my head. It's the kind of story that eats you up, and when it's over, you're surprised that you're still in your house, living your life. You know, even though it's only January, the story has made such an impression, I know it's going to be one of my top favorite books of 2022, hands down. <laughs>